Hello guys! Welcome to this session. Da -da -da. So we are starting chronology. I think we won't finish in five days. I will do on the weekend also. Am I boring you? My husband is thinking, why are you teaching chronology like this? Nobody will like it. Oh, I said, no, 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 it is good. <laughs> did you remember all the things that we did? Do you remember all the things that we did yesterday? Uma, you are my chronology fan, I know. Uma likes chronology. She won't let me stop also. Okay, 1778 we are going to talk about today. 1778 is the year in which William Hazlitt was born. Remember everybody, 1775 who was born? Charles Lamb and Jane Austen. Charles Lamb and Jane Austen born in 1775. 1778 William Hazlitt. And in 1780, our first newspaper, Hickey's Bengal Gazette. Hickey's Bengal Gazette, 1780. 1783, Washington Irving is born. Who is Washington Irving? Washington Irving is the father of American short story. Washington Irving, 1784, Royal Asiatic Society of Bengal. Royal Asiatic Society of Bengal, 1784. And in 1785, Thomas De Quincey. So, 1785, Thomas De Quincey. 1778, Hazlitt. 1775, Charles Lamb. 1775, listen with your brain, visualize it. 1775, Charles Lamb. 1778, Hazlitt. Yo. Or they go. 1785, Thomas De Quincey. 75, Lamb. 78, Hazlitt. Deko yaha. 78, Hazlitt. And 85, De Quincey. Just before that, Royal Asiatic Society of Bengal. Hickey's Bengal Gazette is 1780. All right, everybody. Will you remember? Abhi dekho. How many years after the French Revolution was the first newspaper published in India? How many years before the French Revolution? First newspaper is Hickey's Bengal Gazette. First newspaper is 1780. Hickey's Bengal Gazette, 1780. How many years before the French Revolution it was? French Revolution is 1789. So, nine years. And up. Nine years. Okay, that is good. Then, next. Here they call. 1786. Vatek. Vatek by William Beckford came in 1786. All right. Uh, 1788. Byron is born. 1788. Byron. 1789, French Revolution begins. Are you see what? In 1789, James Fenimore Cooper is born. Also, Songs of Innocence. French Revolution and Innocence. Pehle to, in the beginning, Shudwat me, French Revolution was innocent. But later, it turned into Reign of Terror. 1789, French Revolution. Fenimore Cooper. Songs of Innocence. Uske baad, 1790, Marriage of Heaven and Hell. Milton was the devil's party without knowing it. Remember? 
Milton was the devil's party without knowing it. Who said? William Blake said. Marriage of Heaven and Hell, 1790. 1690, what was 1690, essay concerning human understanding. 1690, essay concerning human understanding. 1790, marriage of Heaven and Hell. How is my rap? <laughs> 1690, essay concerning human understanding. 1790, marriage of heaven and hell. <laughs> Did you like that? <laughs> 1790, marriage of heaven and hell. I think I'm crazy. I think chronology is crazy. Look. Uh, 1790 also, Bill, uh, Edmund Burke's Reflections on the Revolution in France. 1790, Reflections on the Revolution in France. Edmund Burke attacked the French Revolution. <laughs> Edmund Burke attacked the French Revolution in 1790. So, so now everybody, 1789, French Revolution began. Turan Bad, 1790, Edmund Burke attacked. 1791, Thomas Paine replied, Likha. Thomas Paine wrote reply. 1789, French Revolution. 1790, Edmund Burke's attack. 1791, Thomas Paine's reply. Kuch samaj mein aa raha ki nahi? Are you understanding or am I confusing you? Chutnification ho ra kya? Should I rename the course? Chutnification course. <laughs> Listen. Are 1788. Byron is born. Listen. 1770 Wordsworth. 1771 Walter Scott. 1772, Coleridge. 1774, Robert Sade. Born. 1775, Charles Lamb and Jane Austen. 1778, William Hazlitt. 1788, Byron. Is it helping you? Ya yeah, chutnifying you? Byron is born immediately after that French Revolution. <laughs> 1789 French Revolution. Byron is only one year old. One year old. Okay? 1789 Songs of Innocence. Kitna innocent tha French Revolution. French Revolution in the beginning was so innocent. French Revolution began in 1789. Turand Bad, immediately after that. Who attacked? Edmund Burke attacked. 1790. 1790. 1791. Thomas Paine wrote reply. Ta da kya hai? A poet admired Alexander Pope. A poet who admired. Alexander Pope was born 44 years after Pope. Nahi, 44 years after Pope died. Pope died in 1744. Somebody was born 44 years after that. Who was that? Who was that? Bolo, bolo, who was that? Today is rap day. Rap day. Kalyani is rap. <laughs> Alexander Pope died in 1744. 44 years after that, who died? Che, who was born? It is Lord Byron. Lord Byron, 1788. 1744, Alexander Pope died. 44 years after that. Say 
1788, Lord Byron. When was Robert Sade born? 1774. Charles Lamb, 1775. Are P.B. Shelley, when was he born? 17. P.B. Shelley was born in 17. Yaad nahi. Ek bhi yaad nahi kisi ko. Kaha hai P.B. Shelley? Tadadang. Tadadang. 1792. Mil gaya. Mil gaya. Mil gaya. 1792. So P.B. Shelley is 1792. 1795 is John Keats. Did you understand everybody? Did you understand? Okay. Next. 1791 me kya hua? Thomas Paine wrote Rights of Man. 1789 French Revolution. Thakka thakka gang. Thakka thakka gang. Turandbad 1790 Edmund Burke's attack. Tishu. 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 Turandbad 1791 Thomas Paine's reply. 1789. 1791, 1789, French Revolution, 1790, Edmund Burke's attack in reflections on the revolution in France, 1791, Thomas Paine's reply. Are you following me everyone? And 1792, P.B. Shelley is born, P.B. Shelley's mother-in-law wrote, in the year P.B. Shelley was born, P.B. Shelley's mother-in-law wrote a vindication of the rights of woman. Will you remember? Mother-in-law, correct to ma. Mother-in-law wrote vindication of the rights of woman in the year son-in-law is born. Okay? 1793, Songs of Experience. Yaad hai? Songs of Innocence was 1789. 1793, Songs of Experience. Savior Travels of Deen Muhammad by Sake Deen Muhammad was written. First book to be written by First book to be written by an Indian Travels of Deen Muhammad came in 1793. 1794 they call Songs of Innocence and Experience published together. At that time, 1794, P.B. Shelley's father-in-law wrote Caleb Williams. P.B. Shelley's mother-in-law wrote in 1792. P.B. Shelley's father-in-law wrote in 1794. P.B. Shelley was born in 1792. Will you remember? 1792, P.B. Shelley was born. 1792, Vindication of the Rights of Women. Two years back, 1794. Uh, William Godwin wrote things fall things as they are or Caleb Williams 1794 another gothic novel is there mysteries of Udolfo and Radcliffe wrote mysteries of Udolfo 1794 Udolfo 1794 will you remember both end ends with four 1794 Udolfo. Will you remember? How is the called? 1794. Udolfo. <laughs> Will you remember? 1794. Udolfo. Abhi questions. Tadang. Arrange these words chronologically. Rights of man. Marriage of heaven and hell. Vindication of the rights of woman. Caleb Williams. Are, this is easy. Rights of man. Okay. French Revolution, 89. Edmund Burke's attack, 90. Rights of man, 91. 1791. <laughs> 1789, French Revolution. 1790, Edmund Burke's attack. 1791, rights of man. Marriage of heaven and hell ka bha? 
1790. Marriage of heaven and hell, 1790. Vindication of the rights of women, Kabdha, 1792. P.P. Shelley was born. Two years after that, 1794, Caleb Williams. B A C D B A C D How is my rap? Actually, in English literature, we should make rap, na? So that we'll remember. I think after I retire from teaching, I will start rapping. English literature rap. How what do you say? <laughs> बहुत फेमस हो जाऊंगी मैरिज ऑफ हेवन एंड हेल मैरिज ऑफ हेवन एंड हेल सेवनटीन नाइन सेवन नाइन देवन सेवनटीन नाइन वन विंडिकेशन ऑफ राइट ऑफ वुमेन सेवनटीन नाइनटी टू कैलब विलियम्स सेवनटीन नाइनटी फोर बी ए सी डी ओके हाउ मेनी ईयर्स आफ्टर हिकी बंगाल गजेट वीन मोहम्मद पब्लिश्ड पता है इक्कीस बंगाल गजट पता है सेवनटीन एटी इक्कीस बंगाल गजट सेवनटीन एटी इक्कीस बंगाल गजट सेवनटीन एटी ट्रैवल सफदीन मोहम्मद सेवनटीन नाइनटी थ्री इक्कीस बंगाल गजट सेवनटीन एटी ट्रैवल सफदीन मोहम्मद 1793. So, 13 years. Kya famous? I am teaching and 60 people are attending. Wo bhi my fans. Dusre log kabhi attend nahi karte. 79 people. Some people have lakhs. Mera kyun nahi hota? कोई नहीं इट्स ओके माय फैंस आर ऑल हियर दैट्स इनफ चार डैंग 1795 जॉन कीट्स इज बोर्न चार डैंग चार डैंग चार डैंग 1792 शेली शेली वाज थ्री इयर्स का लड़का थ्री इयर्स ओल्ड व्हेन ट्रैवल्स ऑफ दीन मोहम्मद is about dean mohammed traveling he is talking about society he is talking about kings he is talking about indian uh, society nahi sabir kaun bhulega tumhe uh 17 93 travels of dean mohammed 1792 bibi shelly bond 1795 john keats all right john keats was Born in 1795, he died in 1721. P. B. Shelley died in 70. Sorry, 1821. P. B. Shelley died in 1822. Byron died in 1824. Keats died in 1821. Shelley died in 1822. Byron died in 1824. Coleridge died in. 1840 to 34. Coleridge died in 1834. Sade died in 1843. Wordsworth died in 1850. Mary Shelley died in 1851. Tada! Dang. 1821 Keats. 1822 Shelley. The mark says Suno. 1821 Keats. 1822 Shelley. 1824 Byron, 1834 Coleridge, 1843 Sade, 1850 Wordsworth, 1851 Mary Shelley. Tarang. Arey Robert Burns died in 1796. John Keats was one year old when Robert Burns died. Seventeen ninety-six. Uh, the Monk, Gregory Lewis wrote The Monk. Seventeen ninety-eight lyrical ballads. 
उसके पहले ही द बॉर्डर बाय वर्ड्स वर्थ वॉज रिटर्न लिरिकल बैलेंस 1798 ोट्स Wordsworth, Coleridge, and Sade, Lake poets. All right, guys. Da da da. How old was Jane Austen when John Keats was born? Da da da. Jane Austen, seventeen. Jane Austen born in seventeen seventy five. John Keats born in 1795 Jane Austen was 20 years old ठीक है Jane Austen 20 years old How many years after PB Shelley's death did Mary Shelley pass PB Shelley's death is 1822 Mary Shelley's death is 8 1851 tadadang 22 32 42 50 to 29 years tick 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 bibi shelley died in 1822 mary shelley lived for 29 more years after that she died Also, P.B. Shelley was born in seventeen ninety-two. Mary Shelley was born in. अरे कब है? Mary Shelley seventeen ninety-seven. Mary Shelley seventeen ninety-seven. Am I boring you guys? Oh, you will. <laughs> I can't study. So no more are there. 1803 Ralph Waldo Emerson is born Emerson aa gaya 1803 transcendentalist uske baad 1804 Nathaniel Hawthorne 1803 Emerson 1804 Hawthorne Hawthorne criticized Emerson Hawthorne criticized Emerson Emerson was transcendentalist Hawthorne was dark romantic 1803 1804 1803 Emerson 1804 Hawthorne 1805 the prelude is published in 13 books tarang prelude is published in 14 books in 1804 prelude is published in 13 books in 1805 अरे अरे प्रेल्यूड इज पब्लिश इन फोर्टीन बुक्स इन 1850 क्या बात करती हूं मैं सुनो एक बार 1805 नॉट फाइव प्रेल्यूड इन थर्टीन बुक्स एटीन फिफ्टी प्रेल्यूड इन फोर्टीन बुक्स इमीडिएटली आफ्टर वर्ड्स वर्ड डाइड प्रेल्यूड वॉज पब्लिश इन फोर्टीन बुक्स सर्टिफिकेशन हुआ क्या एक बार और 1803 एमसन 1804 हॉथन 1805 प्रीलूड इज पब्लिश्ड इन 13 बुक्स बट 1850 इज द ईयर प्रीलूड इज पब्लिश्ड इन 14 बुक्स ये देखो फ्यूजिटिव पीसेस इज द फर्स्ट बुक बाय बायरन फ्यूजिटिव पीसेस वाज वेरी इमोरल आफ्टर दैट ही रोड poems on various occasions uh, and after that he wrote hours of idleness hours of idleness fugitive pieces 1807 ari lehan's examiner started in 1808 lehan's examiner started in 1808 fugitive pieces byron correct 
करेक्ट करेक्ट यस जावेद अहमद माय स्टाइल ऑफ टीचिंग इज कॉल्ड हिस्ट्रियोनिक टीचिंग न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ टीचिंग ड्रामा रैप म्यूजिक प्लस टीचिंग हाउ टू कंबाइन टीचिंग विद ड्रामा रैप एंड स्टैंड अप कॉमेडी आई नो मा fugitive pieces was so immoral byron's friend told byron burn it burn all the books he burned everything but four copies fugitive pieces by byron 80 not 7 all right guys tanadang in which year did byron first get published first published byron's book is fugitive pieces Fugitive pieces came in eighty, not seven. Ayo, eighty, not seven. Eighty, not seven. Aye, eighty, not nine. देखो बहुत कुछ हुआ. So much happened in eighty, not nine. Eighty, not nine में Alfred Tennyson पैदा हुआ. चार्ल्स डाविन पैदा हुआ अवर हेनरी डेरोजियो भी पैदा हुआ एडगर एलन पो भी पैदा हुआ टेनिसन डारविन डेरोजियो एडगर एलन पो ऑल बॉर्न इन एटी नॉट नाइन टेनिसन डारविन डेरोजियो पो Tennyson, Darwin, the Rosio Po, eighty not nine. Tennyson, Darwin, the Rosio Po, eighty not nine. Or a Thomas Paine died that year. Byron ne bat ke likha English bards and Scotch reviewers. Byron first published in eighty not seven. After that. English bards and Scotch reviewers came in eighteen not nine. Will you remember? They go eighteen eleven. William Makepeace Thackeray is born. William Makepeace Thackeray, chota bacha, eighteen eleven. Usi samay sense and sensibility is published. First published book by Jane Austen. English language teaching methods. ठीक है बनाती हूँ. Eighteen eleven, Sense and Sensibility, first book by Jane Austen. Eighteen eleven, William Makepeace Thackeray born. Turand baad uske baad Robert Browning and Charles Dickens. Robert Browning and Charles Dickens both came in eighteen twelve. Eighteen eleven Thackeray, eighteen twelve Browning and Dickens. Darwin eighteen not nine. Dickens eighteen twelve eighteen not nine में क्या कौन कौन पैदा हुआ जो क्या किया मैंने eighteen not nine में Tennyson Darwin Derosio Po eighteen not nine में Tennyson Darwin Derosio Po Madhusmita only three four days before I did northeast set northeast set के लिए I did two three days ago. All this will help you in northeast slate also. So eighteen not nine Tennyson Darwin there was your po. Eighteen eleven Thackeray. Eighteen twelve Browning and Dickens. They go eighteen twelve Byron is writing Child Harold's Pilgrimage first two cantos. Byron wrote. Child Harold's Pilgrimage, eighteen twelve. Ye bolo. Who of the following was or were born in eighteen not nine? Tennyson, Darwin, the Rosio Po. Bolo. All of them. All of them were born. Tennyson, Darwin, the Rosio Po, eighteen not nine. Will you remember? Tennyson, Darwin, the Rosio Po. Okay. 
who of the following was or were born in 1812? Thackeray to nahi tha. Thackeray was 1811. Browning to tha. Dickens bhi tha. Browning 1812. Dickens bhi 1812. Arnold kab tha? Pata hi nahi. Arnold when was he born? Mujhe nahi pata. When was Arnold born? Bolo. Mujhe dekhna padega. Mujhe nahi pata. Ab loong ko pata hai kya? Do you remember? So now everybody. Arnold is 1822. 10 years after this. Listen everybody. If you have chote chote bache in your house. Ask them to attend the session. Okay. They will also enjoy. That is how I am teaching. कोई नर्सरी स्कूल वाले बच्चे हैं तो नर्सरी स्कूल चिल्ड्रन आर देयर इन योर हाउस आस्क देम टू अटेंड ओके ओके 1812 बॉन्ड ब्राउनिंग एंड डिकेंस टारडांग 1813 रॉबर्ट सदे बिकेम पोइट लॉरेट देखो रॉबर्ट सदे बिकेम पोइट लॉरेट अरे उसी बात Pride and Prejudice. Pride and Prejudice came 100 years before Gitanjali. Pride and Prejudice came 100 years before Gitanjali. Pride and Prejudice 1813. Gitanjali 1913. Are Sons and Lovers also 1913. 1813 Pride and Prejudice. 1913 Sons and Lovers. 1913 Gitanjali bhi. <laughs> इसका मतलब क्या होता है वॉट डज इट मीन इट मीन्स आप लोग तो बहुत बड़े बड़े लोग हैं लेकिन यू आर ऑल वेरी बिग बिग पीपल बट इन साइड यू देर इज अ छोटा बच्चा मेरे अंदर भी है छोटी बच्ची <laughs> 1813, Robert Sade became poet laureate. Henry Pai, what Henry Pai? Henry Pai died and Robert Sade became poet laureate. 1813, he was poet laureate till 1843. Robert Sade died in 1843. <laughs> Ayyo! <laughs> Rahilas Banji. Ayyo! 1813, Robert Sade became poet laureate. Pride and Prejudice written. Hare Charter Act also! Robert Sade became poet laureate. Charter Act passed. Pride and Prejudice. Uh, Geetanjali got Nobel Prize in 1913. Okay, okay. But Macmillan published Geetanjali in 1913, I think. Geetanjali Macmillan wala 1913 I think. Dekhti hoon. Geetanjali Macmillan 103 books. 103 poems. First limited edition is 1912. Lekin Macmillan ka. Limited edition 1912. Okay. Alright. Okay. Then they go 1814. Waverly by Walter Scott. 1814 also Mansfield Park. Taradang. Waverly and Mansfield Park. 1814. 1815. Napoleon defeated at Waterloo. Also. Corn laws were introduced in England. 1815 to 46, corn laws. People did not like corn laws. They protested against it. We don't want corn laws. We don't want corn laws. They protested. Will you remember all this, guys? Abhi kya hodga? Questions. For how many years was Sade poet laureate? 
Sadeva poet laureate from 1813 to 1843 1813 to 1843 to 30 years Sadeva was poet laureate for 30 years. Arshid ki daughter. Uh, hello, Arshid ki daughter. <laughs> 30. Okay, then. Ta da da! 1817. Wow, so many things happened. So now, 1817, Hindu college is established. Henry David Thoreau is born. Remember, Emerson, 1803. Henry David Thoreau, 1817. 1817, Jane Austen Guzar Gai. Jane Austen died in 1817. 1817, Blackwoods Magazine, Biographia Literaria and Beppo. Beppo. 1817 Hindu College, 1817 Thoreau born, 1817 Jane Austen died, and 1817, Blackwoods Magazine, Biographia Literaria, 1817, Beppo also, 1817. Will you remember everybody? Then 1818 School Book Societies set up in Calcutta. Emily Bronte is born. Frankenstein is published. The Revolt of Islam is published. Endymion and Isabella are published. Northanger Abbey and Persuasion are published. Northanger Abbey and Persuasion were published posthumously. Jane Austen. Endymion and Isabella both by Mil uh, Keats. Same year, Shelley's Revolt of Islam. All came in 1818. Are you getting me, everybody? Ready for questions, everybody? Polo, how many years after Jane Austen's death were Northern Garabe and Persuasion published? How many years after Jane Austen's death? Every day's PDF I'm sending in Telegram group. Those who want can join Telegram group. Northern Rabbi and Persuasion published in 1818. It was published one year after Jane Austen's death. Jane Austen died in 1817. Got it? They go 1819. Kya Peterloo Massacre. 1819 is John Keats's best year. 1818 Beppo. 1819 Mazepa. Hello Rajneesh. Thank you for coming. 1818 Beppo. 1819 Mazepa. 1819, Peterloo Massacre. There is a massacre at St. Peter's Field. Then, Walt Whitman born in 1819. Herman Melville also, 1819. Simran, you know why I am writing the, I am making the PDF till the last minute I am doing. That's why I can't send. You want me to send before? I will try. 1819, Peter Lou Massacre, Walt Whitman, Herman Melville, 1819. 1809, Gone Gone Day, remember? Tennyson, Darwin, De Rosio, Poe, 1819. Tennyson, Darwin, De Rosio, Poe. 1812, Gone Gone Day, Browning, Dickens. 
1819 with man melville with man melville are maze pan don you and do no 1819 all the great odes of keats also 1819 keats name 1819 May all the odes he wrote. Then eighteen twenty, eighteen twenty. What it is? Prometheus bound by Shelley. Prometheus bound by Shelley. Eighteen twenty one. Eighteen twenty one. John Keats died. Immediately after that, Shelley wrote Adonai. Eighteen twenty one. John Keats died. And I don't know. After that, Matthew Arnold is born. Eighteen twenty-two. Eighteen twenty-two. Baby Shelley died. Eighteen twenty-one. Keats died. Eighteen twenty-two. Shelley died. Eighteen twenty-four. Byron died. I didn't write that here. Eighteen twenty-four. Byron died. Shelley's last work, Triumph of Life. Last work of Shelley, Triumph of Life. Hari, eighteen twenty-eight, Brahmo Samaj is established. Eighteen twenty-eight, Brahmo Samaj established. Or eighteen twenty-eight, D. G. Rossetti. Kanda, sixteen twenty-eight, Banyan. So no, sixteen twenty-eight, Banyan. Eighteen twenty-eight, D. G. Rossetti. Will you remember? Okay, eighteen twenty-eight to eighty-two, D. G. Rossetti. Sixteen twenty-eight to sixteen eighty-eight, Bunyan. Essays of Elia by Charles Lamb came in eighteen twenty-three for the first time. Essays of Elia. By Charles Lamb. ठीक है? Tada dang! अरे question नहीं था. No question. देखो question नहीं बनाई. Eighteen thirty-two, first great reform act. Eighteen thirty-four, दोनों गुजर गए. Lamb or Coleridge? Lamb and Coleridge both died in eighteen twenty-four. देखो 1835 इंग्लिश एजुकेशन एक्ट मै कॉलेज मिनट है ना मै कॉलेज मिनट एंड इंग्लिश एजुकेशन एक्ट 1835 1836 क्विक पेपर्स 1837 ओलिवर ट्विस्ट डिकेंस बॉर्न इन 1812 डिकेंस अस फर्स्ट बुक पब्लिश्ड इन फर्स्ट नोवेल पब्लिश्ड इन 1836 रिमेंबर 1836 big quick papers 1837 oliver twist 1837 queen victoria came to power 1838 chartist movement will you remember guys so no itne sare 1832 first great reform act 1832 67 84 three years great reform act it was Great Reform Act came in three years: thirty-two, sixty-seven, eighty-four. Okay. Charles Lamb, born in seventy-five, died in thirty-four. Coleridge, born in seventy-two, died in thirty-four. Okay. I think I didn't make more slides. Slides khatam hue. And enough questions were also not there. It's okay, na. I will continue on Saturday also. So we will finish. What do you say? 
Will you come and attend on Saturday also? We will finish 18th century tomorrow, 19th century tomorrow. What do you say? And 20th century, bohot honge na? So much will be there, I think. Let us see. 1837 to 1901, that is right. Uma is an expert. 1837 to 1901. Lecture series for MA English. Nahi, kal bhi hai. Next is not on Saturday. Tomorrow also we will have. Tomorrow also. I, uh, my slides have become exhausted now. Okay? Bye bye. Abhi quiz nahi hai mere paas. Today I had a class in Infosys. I taught them short story writing. And you know what they said? They were saying they are, some of them are attending our YouTube live. I was so happy and proud. They said we are also attending your YouTube live, some of them. Wow, I will do na. Everything 20th century bhi karwaungi. 20th century bhi karwaungi. आज का पीडीएफ भेजती हूँ ठीक है टेलीग्राम ग्रुप में। बाय सी यू लव यू गुड नाइट टा टा हेलो मंजू सांस नितिन एंड मोगित नितिन एंड मोगित गुड नाइट बाय बाय आई विल कंटिन्यू टुमारो ना आई विल कंटिन्यू Tomorrow, day after, ha mock interview bhi karti hoon. Problem is, I'm not getting time for everything. Thoda-thoda karke me karungi. Thik hai? Everything I'll do. Bye.